The amp repair guy dot com two oh three eight nine two four one one nine also Harbach Electronics dot com so Jim V seven RF uh, told me I should make a video on this real quick give me a quick video it's Sunday here so I worked on this yesterday mounted all twenty capacitors to the three quarter inch plywood this is the space the blower will take up the edge of it and I want to leave ample room I can mount some tra the little transformer control transformers or something around it so I have at least a quarter inch between each capacitor they're isolated from ground obviously through the wood the screws do not go all the way through the wood these clamps are plastic so they're all in series. I'll put a 100k 3 watt resistor across each one, and then connect them each, uh, you know, each one to the other with uh, silver plated stranded Teflon coated wire. A short loop. So the positive is here. Starts here and goes around. Dun, 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 dun. And then the negatives right there is a positive negative. So they're spaced from the wall by uh, over a quarter inch, more like half inch, three eighths of an inch, whatever. So this will get secured in the amplifier cabinet with probably, I'll just probably use two machine screws and just hold it down. It's not going anywhere. So getting to work on it. Actually, um, one of the capacitors was damaged. I didn't notice till after I installed it so Jim's gonna send me a couple replacements just to have there's a ding in it it's probably okay but I don't want to take a chance so I'm gonna swap it so I'll get uh, more work done on it I want it I'm 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 gonna get it done this uh, winter I'm gonna get it done when it's cold out and um, show you it working because uh, I'm sure a lot of people excited to see it working maybe some thinking it'll never work but the RF deck was the hardest part now backwards engineering the original stuff will take some thought, but if I didn't have to do all that, this would be done by now. So that's a challenge, and I I love challenges. So and thanks for watching. Ampreparegar.com and also HarbachElectronics.com. Please like, share, and subscribe. If you want to see the videos when they when I get them done, hit the uh, subscribe button. So. I'm going to have 125 microfarads at 9,000 volts here. And Jim's going to give a description on the rest when it comes to the ripple current and all that stuff. Um, the, the current rating and all that. So, see you guys soon. Stay tuned.